to my cast off crew sorry i didn't do one last week i just plainly forgot so i'm very naughty this week my cast off crew is a extra special one and you'll see why in my video but first i will show you what i have made last week so that's what i want to do anyway i'll crack on with it and i'll show you my finished items so please enjoy my video and I'll talk to you soon. I'd first like to show you this blanket that I've made for Gary's uncle's dog. It's just one big massive granny square and got bigger and bigger and bigger. I'm sorry about the light but it's very apt overcast here at the moment so that's a close up of the middle and it's gone to the end it's quite big I showed this in some previous videos a long long time ago with the squares attached together and stuff but that's my granny square blanket so I'm just resting it over the chair until it's ready so I'll show you my next item my next item I did was this uh, pink ruffle scarf it's out the yarn James brought me from Matlock about three weeks ago so that's completed it's quite long but I'm quite pleased with it so I did it on um, size 4 knitting needles so there is my scarf also made oh. another hat here it is and at the top I know I can't remember the name of the yarn but that's that yarn James brought me from Matlock which I quite like it and I've done um, that stitch I don't know what you'd call it, it's just something I made up on my head really. But that's that, I'm quite pleased how it turned out. So there's the back, the top, and it fits quite nicely, so it's for a standard woman's head. And Rita is showing it off quite nice. So I'll show you my next little things. Thanks. Next thing I'd like Bye. to show you is I've jumped on the bandwagon of them uh, rubber band loom things but I don't have a loom at the minute it's going to come by post I'll probably get it Wednesday which I got off Amazon and this one I'm doing it's a dragon tail but I don't have a loom so I'm using a fork and the fork works just as well so there you go and once you get into it it's quite easy so yes this is called the dragon's tail friendship bracelet And here is the lovely. <laughs> James is just going into Ernest Jones to, to get you some jewelry. Yeah, James is pricing things up, aren't you, Doc? Yeah, in Ernest Jones. Yeah.
Arndale Shopping Centre in Manchester. And I'd just like to share with you a lovely little gift that Jan gave me yesterday when I met her. And it's really, really nice. She says it's her first stash, so I'm wondering if it's what she had when she had a shop. And it's really lovely, so I'm just wondering what I'm going to make with this. So I'll just share it with you. It is this. It is so lovely and soft and squidgy. And it's basics. Tira Misu made in Italy. And it is lovely, Jan. It is really, really nice. And it is 100% microphaser. So it is 50 gram and it is, sorry, I should have been more prepared. So, well, it's not acrylic or anything, so, but it's <laughs> lovely. Um... Yeah, but she's given me one, two, three, four, about nine balls of them. So maybe I'll have a go at making a sweater or something or a little cardio or something, which will be fun. So I've never made clothing before. But again, Jan, thank you very much. And it's lovely. And I hope you're all right. I heard you had a little bit of an accident in Iceland today. So I hope you're okay, my love, and get better soon um, and take care. Well, that's Bye. it. I hope you've enjoyed my extra special cast-off crew. And to meet Jan, it was really lovely. And she is such a wonderful, sweet, sweet lady. And we had a walk around Manchester and a little chat. 
and she was telling me about some of the sites and many years ago she told me about the terrorist bomb that went off then in the 90s and showed me where it was all rebuilt and everything and I cannot believe how big Manchester is and it's the very first time that I'd ever been there and I'd like to say Jan it was a pleasure to meet you sweetheart and you must be the loveliest lady that I've actually met for a long time but to meet you off YouTube and to meet you in person it was so great and I was so excited on the way up travelling up I just kept saying to James I can't wait to meet her can't wait to meet her and that shawl that you had on that you made and it's really really pretty and again I had a wonderful time and I loved meeting you and if I'm ever up that way again I hope we can meet up again and this time hopefully it won't be on a match day where I get stuck in traffic anyway that's it then and um, please don't forget to check out the other cast off crew members I'll leave their links down below in the description box please don't forget to like subscribe share my videos with friends and family whatever you want to do so that's it now i'm going to go please take care and ha enjoy the rest of your sunday or you're just waking up sunday good night good morning whatever anyway i'm going to go now and take care everybody and i'll talk to you soon bye